Hey, good evening everybody. Time for more Paper Mario. We're starting off our uh, new schedule here. I'm going to be doing Paper Mario Tuesday, Thursday till I uh, finish it, I guess. And on Saturday I'm going to be starting Pokemon Shield, which is uh, my first time playing it. I've had it, you know, since it launched, but I uh, haven't taken the time to actually play it yet. So hopefully it's a good Pokemon game. I haven't really played since Crystal. Um, I, I did play uh, Pokemon Sun. Um, I didn't finish it, but I've at least seen what modern Pokemon is more or less like. But yeah, we'll see how that goes once we get to it. So here we are off to meet Captain T. Ode. Uh, I think I'm going the wrong way. I am. Whoops. Let me just go around here. And we're gonna, gonna go off to the Great Sea. Here we go. Uh, yeah. Talk to this guy. Let's get going. I think Andrew is going to be watching AW Dark for at least the beginning of this, so... No worries on that, man. Chill stream. Probably not even that much commentary, to be honest. I'm just gonna... Gonna play. You know, try not to... Try not to throw my voice out or anything. Let me bring up the chat here. On my phone. So I can see what y'all are talking about. If and you're talking. No viewers yet. Ah, whatever. Bruh, I don't even I don't even mind. I'm just having a good time playing Paper Mario. And actually since Andrew's not here, I'm gonna turn the music on so that I can hear it. And I'll turn myself up so I can hear myself. There we go. Alright, here we go. This is about the halfway point of the game. I've, I've come quite a ways now. Pretty sure it's the halfway point. Let's see. Sea chart. Hmm. Okay. A scary bonehead. Bonehead Island. Okay. Hmm. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Off to the island. This is nice. Some boat noises. Relaxing. Out on the great sea. Like a pirate of old. Is that it? Is that... Wait. Where am I, uh... Hold on, let me see. Okay, we're on our way. This general direction. Yeah, there's gonna be fog, bro. Yeah. I do like the, uh... The, like, Captain Harlock... Jacket that Captain Teode wears. There it is. Whoa. Oh, hey, it has a dock. Interesting. I wouldn't expect uh, an island lost in the fog to have a dock, but here we are. This part feels pretty much directly cribbed from uh, Wind Waker. But you know what? I'm okay with that. Although, I, I have not played Wind Waker. I've watched the Grumps play it. Um... But I did uh, play Phantom Hourglass, which was the direct sequel. Oh, friggin' controller cable. Uh, the direct sequel on the DS, and was honestly pretty solid. It was um, it was the kind of link to the past, classic Zelda movement scheme, but with the stylus. You just moved around. You controlled the fairy, um, and you moved your you moved yourself around. To the various areas. Uh, is that what I want? Yeah, let's do that. Um, and it was effectively Wind Waker. I mean, it was a steamboat instead of a boat that talks to you, but it was still like the same kind of exploration and stuff. Super fun, definitely. Any fans of Zelda who have not played those games yet, definitely go check them out. They're very, very solid. 
entries into the series. Which, I have a lot of Zelda on the mind because I'm working on a video that talks about Zelda, specifically Breath of the Wild, but kind of the series as a whole. Which, hopefully I'll get that finished sometime in the next couple weeks or something. It's pretty, ugh, it's, I'm going to need to gather a lot of footage, which I might stream a little bit of that. Um, I might stream some of the editing, who knows. We'll see. Maybe I'll keep it as more of a, uh, more of a secret kind of thing. Or if not a secret, a, uh, a bit of just fun. Here we go. Yes, buy it. Coin step counter? Yeah, let's, let's do it. What is this? Oh, okay. So you just actually, like, count your steps like a pedometer. Got it. Hmm. Andrew is still offline. That is, that's fine. I don't know. You guys, let me know. What? How do you, 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 you want more of him? Less of him? I don't know. I don't. I just, in general, I'm gonna presume that uh, presume that what we're doing is doing okay. If there is a way that you think would be better that you would like to see, let us know. Cause I would, I would happily adjust. No problem. This is all more or less for fun at this point, because I don't, uh... I do not make any kind of money off of this. Just enjoying myself. I mean, I guess it's sort of a marketing thing in a way, because, um... It lets any potential clients hear what I sound like. And since most of my work is in voiceover, that's pretty important. Getting my, getting my voice out there, getting all of my... Um, getting my face and image and brand out there and all that. I put a lot of work into it, so hopefully, hopefully it's something that people are enjoying, you know? But even if they're not, I'm enjoying it. I think that's all that really matters to me is that... I'm having a good time playing Paper Mario. Ooh, it's one of the cafes. I love these additions because it's like, yeah, it is basically just a heal up kind of area, but it's a really fun way to handle it. It's a nice little cutscene. You get to learn some stuff about the different characters. Sorry, I just ate dinner, so I'm trying not to be too mouth noisy or biologically noisy or anything like that. I actually have some uh, throat spray, I think. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. There we go. Ah, uh, that helps a little bit. Okay. Spoon. Actually, uh, we looked up these Skull Goombas. I guess they're from Super Mario... New Super Mario Brothers 2? For the DS, um, that game I did not actually play. I played the first one, and I mean it's it's more Super Mario. I I liked it. I had a good time, but uh, I can understand why that one's kind of forgettable to some folks. But yeah, that's where the school Goombas are from. I don't know. My my opinion on the Mario games is that like. As Aaron Hansen has pointed out, they kind of stopped doing anything new after uh, Super Mario World. And I feel like that's just because of a change in business, a change in corporate structure, where the values of the company were just different than what they originally had. So all the innovation they did at the beginning, just trying to make something that would stick, um, was kind of thrown to the wayside in favor of making making something that would appeal to the people who were already fans. And I, uh, yeah, it's, it's not great, you know? It'd be, it'd be better to see them innovate a bit. And that's one thing I like about the Paper Mario series is that they're constantly innovating. Like, this, this series has always kept up with things, you know? No, not... Uh... <laughs> 
my Siri went off because she heard me say Siri. No, oh, it did it again when I was mentioning it. Oh boy. No, stop that, stop that. Whoops, I wasted that fire flower. I don't know. I, don't, I, I didn't want to waste a hammer or anything. Stop it, stop it. No. Can hit. Oh, okay, here's a tricky one. Here we go. Uh, I'll just use the shiny iron boots. Up, yep. Whoop, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, not a lot of viewers. Probably just go go in the other room. Whatever. It's a Tuesday. They uh, there's not usually many viewers on a Tuesday, but that's all right by me. You know, sometimes it's good to just have a chill, chill kind of stream time. I have to be too focused on viewer counts and numbers and things, and just enjoy myself playing a, a game of Paper Mario and there goes the audio capture god damn it it always does this I don't know what the fucking deal is but it just doesn't wanna does not wanna do the audio sometimes so I gotta reboot the Elgato real quick yeah it's just a pain in the ass man I don't know why Elgato is so bad it's like the standard isn't it? Yeah, it's it's like every time I've looked up a list of like, oh, the best capture cards and everything, it's like it's top of every list, probably because of ease of use. Similar to like uh, uh, the Blue Yeti for microphones, because the Blue Yeti is easy to use. I'll admit that, but like, it's a piece of garbage. Like, full stop, because um. It's just not a good microphone. It's it's very noisy. It's very cheap. And yeah, you just plug it in and do it. But it's like, that's not what you really want out of a microphone. You want something that actually sounds good. Although, I will admit, um, a lot of people are way too focused on the microphone when it comes to audio quality. But that's rarely the part that people need to work on. In reality, the part that people need to work on is their audio treatment, like the space that they're in, because if you have a great microphone in a crappy space, it's still going to sound like garbage, so you got to make sure you have a good microphone in a good, good place. Hmm. Oh, I see. Pop it up. Pow. Is that not it? Is that not, is that not it? Oh. Oh. Okay. Uh. Hmm. What's the trick here? I can't do that one. Hmm. Hmm. Puzzle. Ah! Goomba. Oh, man. This battle music is freaking hype as hell. I love it. Or, wait. Is that what I want to do? Which do I want to do? Hmm. Eh, let's just cheer. It's easier. Whoops. Way too much. Oh, well. I've got enough coins. Oh, sweet. Ice flower. Nice. And let's actually... Let's just use some items. No reason not to. I have all of them here, so why not? Perfect. The timing on that is always weird, because if you miss the first one, it just throws off the timing of the rest. But it's not too bad. Here we go. Bam. Perfect. Mm. Oh, it's so satisfying when you hit the action commands right on cue. Can I can I pick this up? Can can I pick this up? No, no, I guess not. Hmm. Okay. Let me think this puzzle through. I see there's a statue of a toad. 
And... Oh, oh he's chilling. What's up? Yeah, he's throwing down bars. Uh, whoop. I can't come back. But I go from the side. Okay. Gotta go around. Let's see. So... There's something to do with the fire. Hmm. Let's see here. So, I bopped these and they popped up. This guy right here. His bone might have something to do with it, but... Can't really do anything with it. Okay. The left eye is out. Hmm. Okay. And this one is also the left eye. And he's missing the same bone. Well, what does it mean? Am I missing something? Can I bop these? Or wait, no, 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 okay, I see. I'm supposed to match it up, and because it's mirrored, it should be that, right? Yeah, there we go, okay. I see your game, you rogue. And then just bop. Hmm. It's nice that the puzzles in this world are all based around hammer swinging and jumping. It'd be really unfortunate if it was based around, like, sword play or something. Wouldn't know what to do. Oop. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Marino. Submarine. Bop. Right here. Can I do anything with this? This this piece of red cloth. Ooh. Okay. Uh hmm. Secret? No, no secret. Looked like there might be a secret. Wasn't a secret. Right, and then I just got it. Whoop! Yeah. Uh Oh, oh. Spin. What does it say? Hmm. Olivia, please. Please, honey. I can't explain all the words to you. Oh, that's a big fan. Oh, it's oscillating. Hey, uh, mm, no, that's not. No. I don't, I've never had a fan that does that. Oh, wait, it's getting rid of the fog. Okay. Generally, if you have an oscillating fan, they just go, like, side to side, right? They don't spin all the way around, right? I don't know. I haven't used a fan like that since I was, like, a kid. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. Okay, so we've opened up the rest of the sea. Perfect. And the audio's out again. Hold on. Let's see if this this makes it last a little longer. Waiting. Waiting. There we go. Let's go. Yeah, let's get out of here. I've done all I can do. Saving. Loading. Here we go. Let's follow the streamer. Here we go. Let's go. A new engine? Oh, well, let's go do that then. Why would I go out on my adventure now if I could just upgrade? To the upgrade! Turn that down. A little loud. A little loud. I always turn it up a little too high. Because it's, it's, I don't like being able to only kind of hear myself. I can, I can hear myself just fine. It's just, um, it's always just slightly lower than I think of as hearing myself. 5,000 coins? Certainly. Certainly, why not? All right, let's go. 
This is gonna be fast. Let's go. Yep, yep, already saw that. Oh, there's a little bit of a little bit of static, sorry about that. Yeah, the one thing about having a cheap boom arm like I have. Whoa! Oh god, it's so fast! <laughs> um, having a cheap boom arm like this is that it uh it has a cheap cable. And that cable, well, it's fine when it's plugged in, uh, doesn't lock into the microphone at all, which is bizarre for a, a microphone cable. Almost every other one I've bought uh, definitely locks right in. So, it's just uh, kind of a pain to have to make sure that it's, it's set up. Whoop, whoop, no, no, turn around, turn around. There we go. Dive, dive, dive down into the depths. Here we go. Huh. Oh, what am I grabbing? It's a rock. Grab the rock. Grab. <laughs> nice. Uh, oh. There. There I see it. Oh. Pull. We got it. Treasure. Oh, is there treasure right there? <laughs> hmm. Weird to have that down there, but cool. I'd figure that'd be like in a, a dry place where I might find those creatures. Whoa. Whoa, I'm so fast. Oh, it's so fast. Oh, what's this? Mushroom Island. Hmm, yes. Yes, I see. Let's go. Let's get on the Mushroom Island. <laughs> nice. Front-facing Paper Mario. I mean, you don't see him too often. Mainly because he, uh, if you try and look at the camera, he flip, flippy around. But yeah, in some of the cutscenes, they'll have that. It's a little creepy. I will agree. Oh, you don't think I know this guy over here? Got him. Hmm. All right. Making sure we got enough confetti. And let's let's find it. And there's gonna be a velamental uh pad. Yep, there it is. Hit it with the fire. <sighs> Flames. Or I guess he uses his wing. Whatever. And we can skip the animation. It goes foof. Bah, throwing up. Oh, I guess he does spit it up. Okay, whatever. She? I don't know. I guess it's Olivia now, so... She. There we go. We did it. We solved the puzzle of... Oh, it's frozen. What What can we do? I mean, it's, it's fun enough. It's just it's such a, like, brain-dead puzzle of just like, Oh, there's ice. Well, what do we do to it? Hmm. What's the book say? What's the book say? Let me read it. Dang it. Can I flip the doormat? No. Okay. Huh. Uh, I have... I have this. Can we use that? <sighs> Fine. Okay. We gotta go find a doorknob. Whatever that may be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's ship out. Toot toot. Here we go. Whoosh. So fast. So fast. Alright, that looks like that's the edge of the sea. 
Watch out. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. I will if I must, but I'd rather not. Crescent Moon Island. Cool. Uh, yeah, let's... Let's do them as we find them. Be a little easier. In the long run. Hmm. It's a pretty empty island. I mean, I guess they can't all be full of stuff, but, uh... I think they'd have some. Yes. Yes. Correct, Olivia. I just thought of something. Is a is a croissant called that because it is crescent shaped, or is the crescent based? Uh, I guess. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like they have a similar root somewhere in there. It's definitely a similar sounding word. Hey, rabbit. Saved. Ah. See. See. Uh, they made the same, the same uh, connection I did. I am at least as creative as a toad, so I'll take that as a compliment. Coins. Nice. Ooh, shiny tail. Fishing. Fishing minigame. Yes. Give it to me. Give it to me. Start fishing. <coughs> uh, I, mean, I guess that guy is the only one out there. All right, let's let's try that again. Whoop! Yeah. Oh, no, you want it? Okay. Let me try it a little more. Whoop! Just move the bobber. One more. Oh, come on. Uh, whoop! No, oh, I scared him away. I'm a fool. Pretty sure this is just gonna be a fight, so. Come on. Come on, take it. Take it! Take it! <sighs> Fine. Whoop! Come on, right there. Right there. Oh! You gonna. You gonna do it? You gonna take it? Okay. How well do I have to reel this? Oh, come on! Take it! Hmm. Hmm. Oh, oh, there we go. It's okay. It's okay. It's not that big a deal. I can get, I can get it again, I swear. Come on. Do the thing. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, get it, get it. No, it is a fight. What is this Thomas foolery? Let me put on my uh, wrist brace. Um. Wait, how do I? How do I do this? Uh, I'm just gonna cheer. I. I feel dumb. It's actually a very obvious solution. Uh, that's the one thing about using the toads is like, if it ends up being obvious, you feel like a friggin' dunce. Great. The flashy hammer. Flash him. Flash him with the hammer. Whoop. Bow. There we go. Nice. Oh, a vellum entel. Oh, I gotta walk all the way around. Okay. Seems a little much. Is this gonna be a, uh, is this gonna turn it into a not Crescent Moon Island? That'd be funny. That'd be pretty funny. Here we go. 
Do it, I think. Well, I'll just skip that. I don't need to see her folding up. Do it. Bounce, bounce around. Yeah, yeah, cheerleader. Oh, a toad statue. A treasure. Mm, yep, it's a circle now. That's cute. That's pretty cute, like. Hmm. All right, Bob. Oh, is the treasure around? I had it noticed. All right, let's get a little more. Confettis. Wow. Hmm. The diamond key. Ha, hmm. How though? How did he, how did he do that if he can't do the earth elemental? How he do that though? Hey, hey guys, how did he get the key? How did he get into this particular treasure chest? Oh well. Oh well, no need to really question it. He's a bumbling and a rumbling along as usual. Bow, bow, bow. More, more, more. 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 I think I maxed out. I can't remember what the if it had another like shiny level behind that. Man, I love Captain Tio. He's cool as hell. Look at him, hands in his pockets and everything. That's a toad I want to hang out with. Let's go back to the mushroom. Do the Mario. Go to Mushroom Island now. Uh, whoop. Oh. Oh, okay, so it's like the, the boot. Oh, jeez. That confetti is really, really struggling. Uh, whoops. Good thing I checked, because I almost went past it. Whoa, a whale! That's cool. Can I do anything with this? Whoa! Woo! That's fun. Hmm. Guess we're just chilling. Okay, this is fun. This is cool. Oh, this way. This way. Over here. Over. Whoa! Let's crashed ourselves ashore. Although I think the uh, hit avoidance is not too difficult to this one. Here we go, Mushroom Island. Now we got the handle. Walking out the backside. Open. Open with the mushroom handle. That handle is huge. Oh, no. I guess it was just enlarged for to, to show texture. I guess. You guys ever seen that on like a box of cereal? It'll be like, the cereal will be just huge on it and there'll be a little disclaimer that's just like enlarged to show texture. It's like, but I don't need that much detail. Also, the visual texture is generally quite a bit different from the, uh, from the actual, like, mouth texture. I got these, the, this Twinkie cereal, like, official hostess Twinkie cereal. Um, and it's one of those cereals that tastes stale when you first, like, open it, which is pretty awful. They also have a donut cereal that's about the same thing. It's just kind of like a powdered... It's like if Fruit Loops were just powdered sugar instead of fruit flavored. But I will say the Honey Bun Hostess cereal is really delicious. Like It's got this nice like vanilla flavor. It's got a good texture to it. Highly recommend that one. The other two, not worth it. That one, 
It's pretty good. It's also Pop Tart cereal, which I personally like. Um, but I, a lot of people find it <laughs> funny. Oh, Luigi. Oh, dear sweet Luigi. This still isn't the right key. <laughs> I love how patronizing she is. Like, she's already admittedly kind of a dummy, but holy crap, not nearly as bad as... <laughs> but still, she can lord it over Luigi, because he's the biggest friggin' idiot. Hmm. Although, I mean, um... She has an excuse to be dumb, because she was just... She was literally born yesterday. Oh, oh, those are stairs. Okay. Thought I had to break my way through. That'd be kind of rude, though. Probably shouldn't do that. I'm a guest in this house. I wonder who lives here. <gasps> Origami. Oh, no. Hmm, yeah. Home? How did you forget this? See, that's the thing, is like, yeah, she was born yesterday, but she also is just a total ditz. That's okay. Sometimes you got you're an airhead, you're a ditz, you're a dunce. Hey, hey, me too. Sometimes you know, I don't blame you that much. But to be clear, Olivia is really dumb, but it's funny, so I don't mind that much. I don't know. She gets on. She got on my nerves more in the beginning, but like as it goes on, now that like there's less tutorials that she has to do, uh. She's a lot more entertaining. So, that's... That's good. I... I I do enjoy her as a character more. And from what I understand of where she goes, because I have seen the end of this game and stuff, um, it's... It's... Uh... Yeah, she, she really does come into her own as a... As a full flesh character. Who does some good... Good things for the world. Hmm. Oh. A hand. Magic circle. Little chair. Hmm. Here we go. Where's, where is it? Where is it? Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, there it is. Ah. Oh, more. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Why? So at the beginning, Olivia was trapped in the wall in the dungeon. Why did Ollie make her if he wasn't going to have her around? I guess maybe she just turned out different than he expected, but it was pretty mean. Oh, I don't care for that. Crease my corners. I love the, uh... That was one thing I really liked about the professor in the desert was, uh... All of his, what was it? Uh, peer-reviewed essay! All of his weird, uh, euphemisms. Hmm. Hmm. Oof. The fold of life. He am play gods. Truly, truly a tale as old as time. What was once but a hobby is now an abomination. Let's go. Hmm. Let's -a go, indeed. Yeah. I do already know where to go from here, but uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna spend a little time exploring because. 
There are some cool things to find out in the Great Sea out there. Ooh. Ah, all the toads rescued. Oh yeah, that includes him. They are going island by island for this one. For the Great Sea, so... Notes, you say? Hmm. I'm gonna turn it down just a touch more. Um... Did the, you guys ever do that? I, this is one of those things that I remember as a kid. Um, if I was like up late at night watching TV by myself, I would always be pretty self-conscious about how loud it was. I didn't want to wake anybody up or disturb anybody, whatever. Um, but uh, as I watched, it's like I just turn it down by a notch every now and then. And a notch doesn't sound like that much, but gradually over time I was able to get down to like some of the lowest settings and still be able to hear it just fine. Maybe that's just me. I don't know. But it's, uh... I, uh generally, my, my method with any kind of volume, especially with headphones, is just to start at the lowest volume and move up until I can just barely hear it and leave it at about that. Like... I'm, I'm very careful about that, considering the... The um, the headphone is just a speaker that's directly on or even in your ear, so the concept of having it at any kind of a high volume is terrifying to me. That sounds awful, especially because at higher volumes, like my ears start hurting, because they're they're fairly sensitive. So it's it's in some ways a strength, in some ways a curse. Cursed to have the hearing of a dog. Eh, it's not that good. It's a bit of an exaggeration, but you know what I'm saying. Ooh, ooh, I'm excited for this island. I did watch Coco do this one, and I mostly saw that it's uh, it's a puzzle. And I do love me a puzzle. There's one thing, it reminds me specifically, I can't remember what it was, but there was a Flash game. Flash game back in the day where it was like a bunch of stick figures in various predicaments on one screen. And you basically had to figure out the exact order. Um, you had to figure out the exact order to help them in. And if you got it wrong, like, they would just die. So, it wasn't too, um, it, w it wasn't too deep, really. Like, the, the solutions were pretty simple once you broke it down. But, uh... Yeah, I, I always I always enjoy playing those games. A lot of those old Flash games, man. I plan to do more showcase, like Flash showcase streams. I did help the hero, which is a game I really love. Um, but I want to showcase more like Flash games because Flash is gonna stop being supported at the end of the year, and it's it's gonna be a pretty sad time. We're gonna lose a huge history of independent game development that does not get a fair shake. Like, it, it deserves a lot more attention than it got because really a lot of really great designers and maybe not so great designers, but really experimental designers made games and were able to do so independently just by learning how to use Flash and stuff. So it was, it was really a great time for video games. People don't really make as many Flash games anymore. You can find them time to time, but it's like, at this point, if you get a, uh, if you make a Flash game, you may as well just make a, a full console game, because they uh, are about the same amount of work, by my understanding. Oh. Button. Hmm. And he's down. And he's up! Oh, he's got a cabbage. What's up? What's up with that? Whoa, button. <laughs> That's silly. That's what I like about these games. They're pretty shelly. From time to time. That that sense of humor. And honestly, like, looking at... um, I was watching a video about the Paper Marios that I didn't get a chance to play. Like, Super Paper Mario, Color Splash, and how... The writing in them is supposed to be apparently super fantastic. Like, people really love the writing in, uh, 
in those games, and I don't blame them. It looks super fun. Ah, crap. Reset. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I've seen Wish. Button. Nice. And we get a heart. Um, wait, that's an origami heart. I don't think that's what I want. Oh, well. Ah, the brother's Murph went live. Cool. I, I have conflicting feelings about them. Not that they're, like, bad dudes or anything. Um, they're just, uh... Ooh, boy, they, they are very clearly trying desperately to be... To be popular and funny, so they they still like. It, it, it's kind of like if the Paul brothers, Logan and Jake Paul, were into board games and not shitty people. Cause like no bones about it, uh, Logan has proven to be a slightly better person, but overall both of those dudes are pretty have done some pretty shitty stuff. Um, but the brothers Murph are just kind of like. Real try-hard. They're not bad people. They're just, um... Boy, howdy. They're trying desperately to get your attention. And hey, it's all good. I like their streams a lot. Like, their streams involve a lot of, like, interaction with the people who are on stream. And they remember people on stream. It feels like a friggin' party. It's super fun to watch, but, uh... Yeah, I'm not, uh... Not the biggest fan of the guys. If just because I don't find them particularly funny all of the time. Although sometimes they, they can be pretty 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 humorous. Alright. Up up. Nice. Ooh. Button. He spin. Mmm, that was it? Okay, that was it. Yeah. Button. It's Hey. Alright. Alright, let's fall down here. Go through there. Get our shelves. Button. Oh. He's fish. Get ourselves a treasure. Or the wallet toad. Hmm. Oh, okay. Well, that's helpful. That's a helpful guy. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. Bam. Uh, a bit of an update on something that Andrew brought up recently was that um, there was the 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 leaks of uh, Super Mario 64 that included like that people also found. Uh, alongside Luigi in that game, they also got the uncompressed audio from Star Fox 64, which is pretty good. And then uh, a few things from Super Mario 64, but also they found the beta audio where they used a bunch of, like, Mel Blanc, like, screams and stuff from back in the day. Which is really weird to hear. It's not great, but it was just designed to, uh... It was just designed to like give give them an idea of how the sound and stuff would work for programming. Hey, you. Oh, coins. Hey, what's up? Coins. 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 Give me more. No come back. No come back, I love you. Hmm. Oh, I did spend a lot of coins on that. Step tracker. Oh. Oh. Where'd he go? No. no. Oh, there he is. Nice. Oh, there. That was it. Alright, where's the nearest treasure? Up there? Let's go. Let's go. Well, placeholder. Yeah, when I say beta, I mean, like, they were in the beta build of the game as placeholder clips. Thank thank you for that correction. Right about here? Right about here. 
Oh, whoop. Here? A little further. Here. No, a little further. A little further. Just a little further. Come on, a little further. Uh, just a little bit further. Just a little bit. Ah, it's close enough. Hmm. Alright, treasure. Give it to me. Give me the treasure. Where is the treasure? There it is. Yoink. Grab. Pull. Here we go. Let's go back to the surface. Da ding. Hmm. Neat. All right. Now let's go for the. Whoop. Do not want advice. That's not what I meant to do. Ooh, the other treasure's pretty far south, so we're gonna just continue on. Continue north. Where's north from here? You guys ever listen to the gorillas? Plastic Beach is is by far one of the best albums. Uh, just period. It's an amazing album. But that that's like such a weird little voice clip. Whoa, we went way farther north than I thought. Okay. Uh, well, let me get into here, and then I'm gonna take a quick break before moving on to the next bit. Okay, I'm gonna pause that, and I will be right back, folks. Uh, mm, which button is it? Uh, that one? Yes, okay, that, and mute, BRB.
All right. I actually have all my shortcuts set up properly, so that's good. Let's get back to it. What is this island? Oh, yeah! I remember when Coco got to this island. We were actually talking about the, uh, this particular game where you put the swords or whatever into the, um, into the barrel to make the little pirate guy pop up. We were actually watching the show Bluey, which... It, yes, Bluey is very much a kid's show. It's like a, it's like a, a Disney Junior show or something like that. But it's um, it's very very good. It's one of the, the like best kids shows I've ever seen, because and and I will um, I, I will point this out. It's it teaches lessons to the parents as well. Like it's actually about parenting, and being a kid and all sorts of different stuff so it's just really fantastic at being a kid show and like being fun while still encapsulating what being a kid is like and it's it's just also hilariously funny like it's it's just so funny um so like highly recommend it yeah if you haven't Go check out Bluey. It's on Disney Plus, or if you just look on YouTube for Bluey, you'll probably find a lot of stuff on there. Um, but in that, they were playing basically this game. Although instead of the swords and the pirate, it was like uh, alligators and like a uh, uh, explorer, I guess. I don't know. Um, it it still looked pretty fun, and in fact, it's featured. I think the first time you see Yugi. In the Yu-Gi-Oh! manga, he is playing, like, basically this game at his desk. <laughs> Instead of, like, having friends and stuff. Which is depressing, but also same. I did, I, I, I spent a lot of time playing multiple person games by myself as a kid. I like tabletop games, alright? A lot of people think tabletop games are boring. And those people don't know what they're talking about. They've just played the wrong tabletop games. That is my that is my professional opinion. And I I shan't change it. Not for you nor anyone. Alright. Here we go. Bow. Bow. I feel like the iron boots are a little bit of a overkill. I always forget to equip my stuff. I don't know what it is. Oop. Adjust the camera. I know what it is, but for some reason, I never think to actually, like, set my stuff back up and equip all of the items I've bought a ton of. Whoa! Get him. Nice. Although, getting back to Toad Town is incredibly easy in this world, because it's literally just the press of a button. Oh boy, uh, I think I have to fight this Goomba to get the last one. Let's check. Bow. Oh, or just do that. Hey, come back. Come back. There we go. Alright, here we go. It's time to save this man. Push. Nope. Push. 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 Get him. Oh! He's naked! Hmm, more treasure. And it's nearby, nice. How do these toads know about this treasure? <laughs> ah, that's adorable. Oh, this... These toads, you know, a lot of people complain about the toads being the only NPCs in Color Splash, but you know what? Toads can be really, really funny. Especially here, where each toad you find has, like, their own little, like, thing to say, and their own little, like, personality. They're not always deep personalities, sure, but they're, uh, they are funny. And that is about all I'm here for, is some jokes, some goofs, some gaffs. Some heartfelt laughs. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, what I said. 
All right, where's it at? Whoa, hey. Hey, you let that go. Give me that. Give me that. No, come back. Come back. Yeah. Give me that. Treasure. Return to the surface. Ah. Hmm. Nice. Ah, speaking of tabletop games, I really need to take the time to um figure out how I'm gonna do some tabletop games on here. Uh, I'll probably do them. I'll probably like I. It won't be that hard because I just gotta basically go to um go and hook up my camera into the Elgato, which should be just fine. And then I'll be using basically this microphone with the table like set up right here. Um, it's just gonna be like a pain to set up because my gaming table, you guys can see it on YouTube and stuff, but it's, it's oh, my gaming table is huge. It's very heavy. I did a uh, like unboxing review thing when I got it, so go watch that if you wanna see. And uh, I'd highly recommend it because I think it was pretty funny. Or at least entertaining, you know? It has quite a few views, I think, probably from people who are curious, because it is a very budget table. But it's nice. I mean, it's exactly what you'd want to have, like, a folding poker table. It's good and heavy, doesn't bounce around or anything. Got that nice felt and padding. Got the nice padded rail with the vinyl. Uh, it has cup holders, but I wouldn't really use them as cup holders. They're really small and shallow, so definitely a way to... Uh, end up knocking your drink directly onto your games. But you know what? It's pretty good. It's, like, the only one I could find that was less than $500. Because, uh, yeah, most of them are, like, 600 to to $1,000. This one was pretty hefty. It was, like, 200 bucks. Um, uh, oop, actually, I'll just do this. It was like 200 something dollars after shipping on eBay, and that's refurbished, but it was refurbished really well. It's a great, great table, and I'd highly recommend it to anybody who's into tabletop gaming of any kind, whether it's like poker, uh, maybe not so much D&D. D&D like, doesn't really need that much table space, at least not 5th edition. If you're doing some OG 3, 3.5, whatever, you could probably use it for that, but, uh, you know. But, Four. If you're doing fourth edition, you definitely need like a ton of space because that's honestly it's more of a war game than it is like an RPG. Who's following me? Who are you? Who are you? Oh, oh. Ah, he's coming. No. Let's see. Uh, you. I should actually have the. Hold on, hold on. I need the toad radar. Oh, oh, this way. Oh, oh. There he is. Got him. Oh, nah, shit. That's all right. I can handle a fight or two. Oh, and the toads are actually gonna help me out. That's so, so sweet of them. It was very nice. All right, we're just gonna pop. Nope, wait. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use a cheer. They're pretty inexpensive, so why not? Uh, yeah. Yeah, sure. That works for me. I have the iron boot. I forgot, literally, after I talked about... I talked about forgetting to equip stuff. I did it again. I forgot to equip stuff. God damn it, I'm an idiot. Ugh. Don't look at my shame. Alright. Take him out. 
crunch, crunch, stomp, stamp. Nice. Alright. Let's see, is that all the toads? Toad radar is not even giving me a blip, so I guess that's it. Um, hmm. It looks like one of them is missing still. That's fine. He's probably up here or some. Bow. Nope. Bow. Yeah. Oh, wait. Is that him? No, that's a shy guy. What are you doing up there, dude? There we go. A thousand coins? No, I barely used it. I'll keep that in mind for later, I guess. Close the umbrella. One last friend. Okay. That's pretty good. Can I take this? Can I take this music? Oh, yeah, I guess not. Mm. Ice flower. When did the ice flower show up? I don't remember it being in the classic games. And then when you get into the new games, they all blend together. It was like... The new Super Mario Brothers... Super Mario 3D Land, Super Mario 3D World. I can't keep track of any of them. The names are just something that's so like, like cookie cutter, generic. Like it, it's they all sound the same at a certain point. So it's like, why, why can't they they be a little more, uh, a little more unique? Oh, there he is. Yes. Yuck! 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 You laughing at me? Oh, that's right. I should have known there was going to be another one. Stop it. Stop it, Hammer Bro. I did it. Be friends. Joy. Anger. Pathos. Humor. Feeling fungi. Hmm. Nice. I'll... Pff, fuck, I'd watch their act. Love it. Alright. The sea looks really big, but it's actually pretty, like... Oh, shit. Get it. Get it. Um, it's really not that big. It's uh, a lot of empty space. You know what? That's okay. I'm having a great time with it. This area is really fun and just, like, relaxing. I guess it just because it reminds me of Phantom Hourglass is the main reason. But you know what? Who said you had to have a great reason for, uh, for liking something? If it's what you like, it's what you like. I... Oof. Sometimes turning around in this ship is a little cumbersome. Uh, I also, ooh, I also got to go back by the Princess Peach to get the last bits and bobs from there. Whoa, what's that? It's like a whole dang, like, skyscraper. Oh, jeez, watch out. Oh, jeez, watch out. <sighs> There's always a lighthouse. Always a lighthouse. Although this lighthouse is less dark and spooky compared to, uh, compared to Bioshock. Ah, there's the, the warp pipe. Okay. Oh, hmm. It's got some divots. I wonder what those are. Woof, yeah. That's a tall one. The purple streamer. Hmm. Yeah, let's figure this out. You and me, Olivia. Team. Pop. Got the timing wrong on that. 
The thing is, too, with the Elgato is that uh, the capture, I believe, is like just a half second lagging behind what I see as I'm playing. So if there's any weird oddities where I like react to something before it happens, that's why. Don't know what to do about it, really. Hmm. I wonder what. So, uh, probably some red, blue would greed if I had to guess. Hey, you're blue and round. Can you can you fit? Can we cram this toad in there? I think he'll I think he'll fit at the puzzle. Watch out! Watch out! I don't want to fight those guys. All right. Toot toot toot. Here we go. Down south. Are there any other island? Whoa! Ooh, I know you don't take damage, but woof. That was, uh, that was scary. Also, I think there's probably a treasure here. Looks a mite suspicious. Let's see. Let's see anything. Hmm. These guys. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Let's see. I saw some more over. Hey, hey, you guys. Get out of here. Extend. Grab, 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 grab up, grab up. Arr. He gotta tickle the fish so it'll get out of the way. Arr, 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 arr. Grab him. It, oh, okay. I gotta do the thing. Okay. I was hoping I could just kill two fish with one uh, grip. There we go. Got the treasure. Excellent. What we get? It's a thousand gold coins. I think just coins. What do they call it in this? They they always kind of slightly change up what it's called. Although not so much in modern Mario's. Um, Mario RPG was just like dollars. I'm pretty sure. Because they were just like, ah, eh, screw it. Who cares? I, oh wow, oh wow, there really is a lot of open space out here, it's fun, especially being able to zip around like this, that's super fun, hmm, I'll call it Hammer Island, looks more like a signpost to me, but that's, uh, that's just a personal preference, let me out, let me out, I must explore, Skip. Here we are. Whoop. Oh, the treasure's right there. This is going to be super easy. Hmm. Or is it? Something seems a mite too easy. Hmm. Should I trust this? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. It's... Ooh, a legendary hammer. The strongest and well, uh, yeah, there we go. I like that they don't make any bones about it and just straight up say like the strongest and fastest in the game. Thanks, I appreciate your uh, your transparency, dude. I don't want to have to figure that out for myself, to be honest. Like I could probably look up a fan wiki or whatever, but nah, it's too much work. Just let me, just tell me if it's the best one. Appreciate who? Okay. Yeah. The Fire Bros. Wah. All right. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna cheer on this one. Here we go. Help me out, guys. Woo. Oh, nice. I didn't need to heal, but, uh... I said, God damn it, I forgot to equip shit again. Ugh! Ignore me, I am stupid. I always forget what I need to do. It's alright, it's alright. I got it. Just gotta remember for after the fight. Bow, bow, bow. Crushed. 
No, my boots. Oh, okay, that's it. Thought that was a wave battle. Hmm. No, the confetti! Burned away. Um, nope, that's not what I meant to do. No, 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 I got it, I got it. Uh. Thank you, though. Thanks, honey. It's very nice of you. I'm glad you're keeping up with it. And the... Flashy boots? Yeah, let's go with the flashy boots. And let's pop some, uh, some shiny hammer. Uh, nah, I'm good on hammers. Alright, let's swing around here. Another, another treasure, huh? Hmm. Oh! What's in here? It's a heckin' hammer treasure. Collectively. Hmm, can I jump up here? Ooh! Sneaky secrets! Sneaky secrets! Ooh, Captain Teode himself. Get him. Nice. Bow. Bonk. Uh. Oh, this is an easy one. Pow. Kapow. Done and did. Here we go. One. One. Another, another. <coughs> one thing about doing tabletop games, the one I mostly want to do is Root, which is my favorite tabletop game. It's it's just an asymmetrical war game, but it's got adorable, kind of Calvin and Hobbes looking artwork. It's beautiful. Um, but I... I might, well, I might do some of the tabletop regardless, but uh, they're actually making a digital version soon, which looks... Uh, well, we'll get into it when you watch it, but suffice to say, I'm a little disappointed, because the artwork is the best part of the uh, original game. And this digital version, uh, well, yeah. Uh, just go look up... Um. Root Digital by uh, Direwolf Digital. It's a on YouTube, and then look up on um, BoardGameGeek.com. Look up the game Root and just look at some of the pictures, and you'll you'll probably get what I'm saying. The two really just don't compare, and it it oh man, it's unfortunate. I was looking forward to it because I actually got like. I got advanced info on that. I was at BronyCon last August, so about a year ago, and um, I heard from somebody while playing Root in the tabletop room that a friend of theirs was actually working on the digital edition. I was like, awesome, because I'd heard no news about that prior, and then like, yeah, uh, they finally put out some stuff about it, and it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's disappointing. I don't know. I'll get it. I'm absolutely gonna buy it, probably in both Steam and um, um, and like mo maybe mobile. I don't know. My phone might be a little small for it, and my iPad is definitely a little too old for it because it it can't handle most modern apps. But I think I mean I only have to buy it on one. I'm pretty sure with the way that Apple does it. I am for certain getting the Steam version, because I, I, the, the thing with Root and a lot of heavy tabletop games is that they're very fun, but they're a lot of work to set up. <laughs> There's just so much setup to do, and I enjoy setting up and breaking down and stuff, like that's, it's a ton of fun. It's just, uh, ooh, it's something of a headache sometimes, you know, and to have a version where you just turn it on and it's all ready to go. That's that's the dream, guys. Truly. Uh, oh no, am I gonna have to take these guys out? All right. My poor boys folded into origami. 
Oh, whoa, whoa, is they? Um, I th I believe I've said it at some point prior on these streams, but Spike is my favorite Mario enemy character character in general. Like I like all of them, but Spike, Spike is my guy. He's a he's a wonderful little dude. Um, and I wish he was playable in more stuff. You know, I desperately want to see him as a companion in Paper Mario at some point, but that's also if they were doing the traditional Paper Mario, like the, the original N64 one, and they're probably not ever going to again. That sucks, because, like, I, 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 do, I do enjoy this, but I much prefer the original. So, yeah. I don't know what to say. Uh, just, it's another one of those things where it's like, this isn't a bad game, but it's it's just not quite the same as as what I what I grew up with, what I what I truly want. A pow block. Ooh. Okay. Open. Open the secret. Question block. Hmm. Nope. It doesn't let you go down there. I figured it was like a secret or something. Oh well. Oh well. Uh, I didn't even need to heal up. What am I doing here? Alright. Let's see how well this pow block works. Y'all ready? Here we go. Pow! Oh! Oh yeah, that's satisfying. Whoops! I meant to hit him with my hammer, but I was distracted by the coins. Hmm. How am I gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna cheer. I don't think this one's... If it is possible, I just don't see it. And why waste time? I'm gonna spend 500 coins. And they'll just land it right up for me. A hundred? My goodness. Not even necessary. But thanks, guys. Flashy boots. Chunk. Chunk. Crunch. Crunch. Ah. <laughs> Sorry, I heard a noise uh, over by my door. And I looked over and um, my cat... Has had his like paw stuck out under the door, which he does sometimes when he's uh really attention hungry, or just actually hungry. Well, just he's a very food motivated creature. But uh yeah, that ooh that really like s scared me for a second. <laughs> oh man. Hmm. How am I to... Uh, uh, let's just cheer again. I know it's lazy, but you know what? I don't have to go through this. Ah! Oh! They crunch the man. Um. Well, that's not incredibly helpful. Oh, wait. Nope, this way. I got it. I got it. I figured it out. Don't give me crap. I mean, you can if you want to. I don't really care. I have thick enough skin. I'm a goddamn working actor. I face rejection every day of my life. Well, not every day. As many days as I can. Hmm? There we go. All right, now let's get the coins. Here we go. Oh yeah, go nuts for the coins. Oh, ho, ho, ho. this, these are the moments that I live for, man. In a Mario game, when you just get to go nuts and pick up a ton of coins, it's so satisfying. It makes me think when I was like a really young kid, I went to a. Uh, 
uh, a cat show with my mom. Like, a, you know how like there are dog shows? It, it was for cats, specifically. And my mom raised cats. Uh, but, yeah, when we were there, I like... I like came up with this game where you would basically like... How did it go? It was just like you had a, a notebook and you would... um. You would, uh, you would fill it in, you would, like, completely color it in with a pencil, and then you would basically just race to see who could erase it faster, and it was, I mean, in my mind it was like a, a lawn mowing thing, um, basically, as far as themes go. It, it was dumb. I mean, I was, like, really young, but it's one of the games I've made. And there's another game I made for a contest recently that I'm going to look, I'm going to check the rules. Because unfortunately I didn't place in the contest, which, whatever, that happens. Um, but, I, uh, uh, I am going to see if I could, like, maybe one day publish it myself. Like, do I still retain the rights to it, is the thing. I have not checked quite yet, but there is a chance that I might be able to do that, at which point I would probably polish it up and take it to Kickstarter. It's it's pretty simple, it's just like a kid's game, so it's not like the most advanced stuff, but the one kid I know really liked it. So, that's at least something. Bow. Popped him like a ruddy pimple. Alright. Gotta get all the confetti I can. Um, hey, wait a minute. Sneaky, sneaky. Hey, thanks, little buddy. I mean, that's more than a lot of these toads give us. Most of them don't really give us anything. Which isn't necessarily a problem. They give us a sense of accomplishment. Oh man, my nose is just really stuffed up. I apologize. I'm, I'm just like g turning away to like try and clear it up a little bit. I might do some nasal spray in the other room on my next break. But um, in the meantime, I'm trying not to sound too, too stuffed up and de nasal, you know? Get ah, there we go. Nah, I don't need to. Thank you, though, Mr. Toad. Mrs. Toad? I don't know. I mean, there's Toadette, so they imply that there's a way to tell their gender apart, but who knows? Gotta get some confetti. Give it to me. I really like these fat palm trees. All the palm trees around here are, like, really tall and slim. Uh, they're kind of neat. I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't really care for palm trees, necessarily. I really miss the, uh, the nice big Douglas firs of the, the Pacific Northwest. That's a real forest. Although I don't think anybody claims that... Anybody claims that the, uh, the trees around here form any kind of a forest... Gotta kind of slalom around here. Don't want to miss any islands. Uh, let's go over there. Whoop, watch out. I'll be to disturb you there. What do you got to say? Giants! Hmm. Okay. Well, I will definitely look into that. Guess over here? Somewhere? Whoa. Hey, wait a minute. Uh, nope. Those are the, the, the folded. Don't want that. Aha! Here's one. Square. Ooh, we're like right on the bottom. Okay. Um, I haven't checked the bottom right or the top right corners, so I'll probably check those next. I could just like go like I know what the um what the uh the trick is to getting to the next part. I'm just 
Just being a bit of a completionist for right now, you know? Having a nice time. Scuffle Island. Locked in. Hmm. Uh, no mushrooms. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. I think I can do this. The Paper Macho guys aren't that difficult. You just gotta keep an eye out. Alright, here we go. He's running. Not for long. Sticker one. Sticker two. Sticker three. Oh, whoops. Oh, wow. That was a lot of damage. Ooh, boy. Oh, okay. So he is still just the... Goomba, but you gotta get all of his stickers first. Got it. You know what I might consider playing on here sometime? I've played quite a bit of it, but it's, uh... Valhalla. The cyberpunk bartending simulator. And it's it's purely a visual novel. But it's a very cool visual novel, and the characters are very fun. So I will probably do it at some point. We'll see. I definitely want to finish it at some point. I, I stopped about partway through. Because, uh... I don't recall. I guess I just didn't feel like playing it, and then that went until I forgot about it. Nope, watch out. Get him. Bop. Whoa. Woo -hoo -hoo. That was very close. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, this is not going well for me. Oh. Shit. <laughs> that did not go well. Oh no. Oh no, I don't remember where my last save was. Ooh. Oh, okay, it saved as I came here. Whew. That could have been a lot worse. Oh boy. Um, Let's go with some regular mushrooms. Just a couple of those should be fine. And here we go. Welcome, welcome. It begins now. Oh, jeez. I do really love the paper macho characters. It's such a, a, a clever inclusion. Bam. Ooh. Oh, oh geez, I don't think I have time. Get him. Ah, oh, yeah, there we go. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come at me. Wait. Pop. Come on, buddy. Come on now. It's like uh, bullfighting. But uh, instead of stabbing them with a sword after you already captured them for your friggin' fighting thing, which is pretty rude, swag them with a big ol' hammer. Continue. Bring out the next. Bring out your dead. Here we go. Round two. Ready. Fight. Uh oh, watch out. Okay. All right, there we go. Whoop. 
Watch out. Watch out. Let me get, get, yeah, there we go. Ooh, I'm being very careful because while he's not, it, whoa, he's not exceptionally difficult, I do have to go through seven of these guys, so, whoa. Oh, watch out. So I don't want to get too hurt too early. Watch out, watch out. Oh, shit. It's okay, it's okay. I got him. There we go. And a little bit of health. Huh. A little bit of health never hurt nobody. Cool, cool. All right. Let's continue. I got this. It's a paper... Macho... Koopa. Creeps me out that you can't see him in the shell. You can just see straight through. Come on, then. Come at me. Shit. Shit. Alright, watch out. Oh, 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 fuck, really? You get hit by the blowback? Okay. Taking it serious. Watch out. Fuck. Nope, nope. Maybe. Can I? Nope. Just gotta watch out. Gotta watch out. Ooh. Ah, fuck. Alright, alright, alright. I can take him out. I can take him out. If I can take him out, I'll at least survive. Watch out. There we go. Got him for one. Ooh, watch out. Ah, fuck. Okay, I'm probably gonna do this bit later, I think. Right now, I'm, uh... Yeah. I'm not doing so good. Wait. There we go. Alright, let's continue. Let's continue. Get some of those treasures. Find some more wonderful things out in the sea. Hold on. I always, like, kind of chill forward to try to hit the mic, and that just, like, that crunches up my vocal cords. None of that. I can always move the microphone. Why not? That was my main problem when I, uh, would use the phone, like, pointed at the microphone to bring in guests. Um, is that I didn't really have much control over how the mic was placed, and that led to a lot of cramped necks over time, but it's not too bad. Not too bad at all. <coughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Ooh, do not want to deal with that. No, 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 thank you. No, 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 thank you. Okay. Right about here. A little further. Little further. That's good enough. All right. These parts are so nice. It's just it's it's so relaxed. It's all spooky. Which is cool. Just kind of listening to the the sounds around you as you sit in the the submarine. Hey, oh, origami workbench. I wonder how many of the uh, various things I've gotten. Maybe I'll check next time I head by town. Thunk. All right, let me check out this corner. And get that treasure. Hmm. Yeah, there's got to be an island somewhere around here. Ah, there's a big old arch. It's not really an island, but... Um, Alright, looks like I gotta... squidge back around anyway, so let's... Whoosh. Hey. Hey, pick me up. I want up. No, is he not gonna do it? Maybe if I go fast. No. If I go, oh, oh, put me on the spout. 
Yeah. <laughs> nice. Alright, let's see. Go through the arch. Anything? No. Is that where the treasure is? Hmm. Well, I'm gonna check. Because, like, the... I don't think they'd put this in here if there wasn't something. I guess it could just be an ambient thing, but it took all the time and effort to put it here, so why not check it out? Let's look. Let's look around. Hey, wait a minute. Hmm. Nope, guess not. Let's see. Any treasures? Any delicious treasures? Anything? Anything? Hmm. Oh! There, there's the bastards! Come on. Here we go, here we go. Grab, bolt, got it. Nice. Excellent. Let's return to the surface. Let's. Ding-a-ling. Paper macho gooper blooper. Hmm. Nice. All right, and then the treasure I was actually coming out here to find is right over there. Here, a little north, oh, a little this way. Go, go, go! Hmm, get him, get him. Mine. Give it to me. There we go. Excellent. Let's return to the surface. Paper Macho Stone Spike. Mmm. I do like the Paper Macho Spikes a lot. I just like Spike in general. He's my guy. I love him. Okay, let's we'll see if there's any islands out here. Seems a pretty big area to be empty. Alright. Uh, you know what? I am going to take a another quick break here. Uh, I might finish a little earlier than usual. So, yeah, I'll be RV, folks.
Hey, I'm back. Uh, sorry, I had a client I was talking to, which I always make sure to make time for my clients, even if I'm currently busy with something else, because that's just professionalism. Just gotta, you just gotta keep up with, with the folks, make sure that they're happy with everything that's going on, and yeah, if you wanna, if you wanna be able to sell your, uh, sell yourself, you gotta be able to actually be there to do the selling. All right, here we go up. And treasure, give me, give me the treasure. There, nice. Sorry. Once again, gotta talk to clients, bro. That's professional, baby. Professional baby. Boss baby. Or or lesser baby. I don't know. You guys see Boss Baby? They had like a whole corporation of babies in that movie. It was pretty, pretty, uh, pretty dumb, to be honest. It's not a good movie. <laughs> but there's funny stuff, you know? Mm -hmm. Anything else? Anything else I can crush and get some coins? Oh man, I'm getting like a pretty bad like kind of nasal click now because I did that nasal spray. I don't know if you guys can even hear that, so ignore it if you can. I apologize. I don't know, my allergies are acting up. You gotta do what you gotta do with them, you know? All right. Oh yeah, DJ booth. Once again, I feel like they're like backtracking to get all the ones from the last chapter world, whatever that I was in. Here we go. Here we go up north. Anything cool up here? Any interesting islands? Hey, there's a shy guy. What do you guys say? Hmm. Toad statues, eh? Hey, wait a minute. Well, that's a suspicious, suspicious outcropping. Hmm. Looks like fish. Looks like some tropical fish. Grab. <sighs> here we go. Anything more out here? Whoosh. No. The blooper. Alright, I think that's everything out here. There might be one or two things I've missed, but I am going to come back and do more 100 percent -y sort of stuff later. Ah, shit. Hey, what's your deal? Hmm, a reef shaped like a blooper, eh? I mean, you're going to need a boat first. That's, that's certainly the first thing you're going to need. Um, you know, let's go back to the Princess Peach, actually, really quick. Before I forget. Oof. Kathunk. I wanna... I know there was, like, one last treasure and maybe a toad on there. So I want to, uh... I'm gonna deal with that now before... I get too distracted. Ooh. 
Where was it? It's not that far out, is it? Um. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There it is. All right. Oh, it wasn't on the sea chart yet? I get, yeah, I guess Captain Teode had not seen it yet. All right, let's get on this sucker. Let me on. Let me see what's up. Hmm. Wonder if it's all cleaned up now. Or if it's still all a mess. Let's go to the map. Mm, yes, I'm missing the treasure. Okay. Toot toot. Hmm. Okay, so this is actually the perfect time to do this. Let's see. Where's the treasure at? Come on now. You can't hide it from me. I'll be sure to find it. How's it going, Hattie? Not good. <laughs> Sorry. I, I don't know if any of you watch Worthy Kids, but I, I love his animations. And for whatever reason, the one uh, the one about the hatbox ghost from the Haunted Mansion is, like, my favorite by far. It's just something about it is, like, kind of spooky, but also, like, really cute and fun. It's hard to describe, but I love it. I love it so much. Du -du 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 -du. Jump, jumps, many, many jumps. Hmm. No treasure back here. I mean, aside from the one I opened. Let's try upstairs before we go inside. Mm. I'll probably go in there in a minute. We'll just... Goinch! Nice. Okay, now we gotta go inside. See if it's there. Bow, bow, bow. Oh yeah, it's probably through here. Since this was all blocked off last time. Ding -a ding -a ding. What's up? Hmm. Neat. Can I break stuff? <coughs> Can I break it all? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know, I'll, I'll come back here if I can't find it somewhere else, but as of right now, it doesn't look like it's there. Oh my god, excuse me. I busted the mic up a little bit. Excuse me. Sometimes you talk a little too loud and it makes a lot of noise. Oh yeah, you're not allowed to do that. Hmm. Would be neat to be a captain. But there's a lot of work you gotta do to get to that point as a as 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 a not captain, so who knows? Who knows if it's really as good as they make it out to be. Sneaky secrets. Where are the secrets? Secret secret, I got a secret. Do, do, secret, secret. Oh, do, 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 secret, secret. I got a secret. Mm, secret, secret. I got a secret. Uh, through here. You're so quiet, my man. I'm so sorry. Why must you be so silent? So quiet. Hmm. 
Well, they, fi they fixed everything up, so that's good. I wonder if that helps me at all, or if that's important. Hmm. No, it doesn't seem to make much difference. I, hmm? How am I supposed to get that? Secret block? Oh. Not so secret block, actually. As it turns out. Back up, I guess. Where the hell is it? I guess it'd probably be in the VIP room since I didn't get or did I get to go there before? Don't recall. Hmm. Hmm. Where is it? King Lounge. Maybe it's in here. Yeah. Yeah. And who are you? Hello? Might I remember a signature? The shippy sippy. I love it. Mm. That's good stuff. Oh, I can't get back up. Pancake! Can I eat this? Can I, can I eat this? Guess not. Guess they just have food laid out. What the fuck is this? It's nasty, guys. Can't just leave food out. That is poor, poor food service. Hmm. Yeah, I just can't find this other treasure. What's up? Maybe there's another place to go in the elevator? It just takes me up here. Hmm. Oh, wait, what about through here? Why'd I miss that? No, that's the way out, right. I'm dumb. It's gotta be in here, right? It's gotta be like some kind of trick. Something. Gotta whack with my hammer. Uh, you? Can I whack you? Friend. What is the secret? <laughs> yep, we're. Uh, we are. Certainly stumped. Where is the treasure? Where is that? I don't know. I'll, I'll come back another time. In the meantime, let's move on with this and get to the next area. I think it is a sh another elemental shrine? Maybe. I don't remember. Let's see, we've already gotten fire, fire, earth, uh, water. Uh, means wind, I guess? Air? And there's like a fifth one that I've heard about. Hmm. Oh, north we go. Hmm. Just gotta find the exact center. See, because it's 
hearts, heart spades, clubs. But where's the diamonds? Where's the diamond at? Where could it be except for right here? That's right. I've bamboozled you. I knew the whole time. Here we go. I like that the bubbles look like wood chips. Oh yes, a large diamond. All right. And we have the diamond key already. So let's pop it in there. Ah, an opening. Pop it in. And then we gotta turn it. Oh. Oh, nearly. There we go. Took three turns. Should have only taken like two, I feel, but you know. Oh well. Heck yeah, we should head inside. Let's go. Let me in. Let me in. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I see. Now we gotta get this stuff. Hmm. Your trials are just beginning. Power, wisdom, and courage. Hey, that's a Zelda. A legend of Zelda, in fact. Let's do it. Let's do it. I have not seen any of this area, so all of these puzzles and such are new to me. So let's, let's just head in. Well, actually, let's explore a bit for a minute catch any toads or what have you. Whoa, what's this? What kind of crazy magic circle is this? Any elemental power? Oh. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, so I guess I get to choose? I, uh, I think I'd just use the earth there, right? I don't know. Let's, uh, let's continue on. See, think. There we go. And what's up here? Hm. A bear. Hmm. It's pretty chilly over there. All right. Let's see what's up. Let's see what's up up there, where the thing is. Huh. Hey guys, how you doing? Hope you're having a nice time. The ice elemental. All right, let's check it out. Oh geez, oh geez, they're coming. That's all right, I can avoid them. Later. Oh, uh, they're so dumb. They don't even know what they're doing. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Oh my god, they're so generous. They're so generous with the amount of time that the coins are around in this one. I mean, seriously, in the in the first one, I mean, you guys saw if you, uh... What? In the first one, you guys saw it was, a. Uh, um, it was, uh, b -b 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 it was like half a second before they started to disappear. That was a pain in the age. Ah, oh, shit. Well, guess we're fighting. I'm going to have two turns. Haha. -ha. And this is how I'm going to do it. Oops. 
There we go. Here we go. Slap him. Excellent. Oh, they made a green in here so it's easier to see. That's cute. That's clever. I like it. I gotta say, I definitely enjoy it. puzzle. Okay. I see. Ice. I, 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 I see. It is icy. I see that. There we go. Oh, oh, get the coins, get the coins. Get them, get them, get them. Oh, shit, shit. Ooh, I'm still not, uh, still not used to the sliding. Ooh, ooh. All right, all right, all right. This is an easy one. I can figure this one out. Come on, come on. What do you think I am? Some kind of, some kind of dunk? Oh yeah, this is way easier than most ice pushing puzzles because you don't gotta leave the single block. Nice. Well, that was a secret. So let's see what's through here first. See if that's Somewhere I'm gonna have to continue. No, no. Okay, cool. Here we go, here we go, here we go now. The finally here performing for you. It's the first member of the DK crew. Oh, DK. Donkey Kong. Oof, chonky boy. Well, I'm gonna go deal with this guy, I guess. Here we go. Whoa, watch out. What, that doesn't initiate a fight? He just gets to do damage? That's some freaking Kentucky Fried nonsense right there. Oh, okay, and I don't even get to like start the wave battle myself. Wow, wow, okay, wow. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, this is. Wait. Hmm. So I'd want to do it there. Pop him here. And then we. Bow. Yeah. That's the way to go. Alright, here we go. Flashy boots. Pop. Bow. Pop. Bow. Now I got the Velemental. Hey, I'm brimming with Velemental power over here. See, why are those guys sharp, though, if you can just stomp them in the eyes? Like, it's not even that hard. Yep. Here we go. Burn them up. Flames. Nice. I was it. Uh, I mean, I probably could have probably just dodged all that, but you know what? Sometimes, sometimes dodging isn't what you want to do. <coughs> sometimes you want to take your sweet time. Oh wait, no. Actually, I did have to do that. Well, okay. That's fine. Yump. Yow. Jump. Jump. Whoops. Oh, come on. Just let me go across. Hmm. I wonder how I will break them as I look at the, the clear handprint on the floor. Yes, puzzles. 
Yeah, it's puzzles, bro. Let's do it. Watch out. Ooh, watch out. Hmm. I might have messed this up already. Looking at it, looking at it. I messed it up. Yep, yep, I messed it up. Can I reset this? Is that what this is for? Yeah, that's what that's for. Okay, I like that. You just gotta set up the, the boozle. Okay. It's not exactly hard. Damn it. Oh, couldn't avoid that one. Yeah, let's just cheer. I can kind of see how, what they want me to do, but it's too much work. Here we go. Here we go. Take him out. Take him out. Bop. 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 Baru. Let's do it. And... Ah, crap. A little early. A little early. Ouch. Hmm. Line him up, you say? I guess... Yeah, like this? Why would I need three? Three seems like too much. Maybe it's just to throw me off. It's a, it's a sneaky trick. Done by a spiny. Keep it going. Keep it, keep it, keep it going now. About, just about, squab up, and a scrowl. Here we go. Nice. That was fun. D hey, mm, I don't even get to take credit for that. That makes me feel bad. Olivia, Olivia won't even let me take credit. Punch. Oh, nice. It's opening right up for me. Bleh. Hmm. Okay, let's go through. Should have probably saved after doing that, but I'm, I'm unlikely to die. This game is not really that difficult, but I have to worry about it. Hmm. Oh no. They're dropping balls. Gotta watch out. Gotta watch out for the balls. Oh, I can just break them? Well, that's easy. Break. Oop, oop. Nope. Let me out. Let me out. Ten damage. That's nothing. I take ten damage when I'm crossing the street. You know what I'm saying? Oh, if I want that treasure, I do, I guess. Shit. Okay, let me just... Can I get it all? Can I get it all? Come on, I can get that. That last one. Yeah! No, I'm gonna miss out on it. Okay, well, let me hit this guy first. I got it, I got it, I got it. It's alright. Nobody worry about me. I'm alright. Everyone should not worry about me. I'm doing okay. Nobody should worry about me. Yo, listen to that song. Sometimes I wonder if, uh, should we have worried about him? Has anybody seen him lately? Is he doing okay? I don't know. I don't even know who that is, to be honest. 
Was it Huey Lewis and the News? Or was it Kenny Loggins? I always get those two mixed up. They have very similar styles in my mind. That's just how it is sometimes, you know. Hammer Crush. Bam! No, that didn't take him out? Okay. They're not even, like, a threat, so... Who cares? I don't even care! There we go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I did it. I did it, guys. Gotta open the chest. What do I get? It's a friggin' Buzzy Beetle. It's a heckin' Buzzy Beetle. I'm going to guess that there are... Uh, there are 100 treasures. Oh, I missed a couple. Oh, well. No big deal. No big deal. Not for me. Got him. Nice. And I'll just ignore this one because he's not blocking anything that I care about. Or not. Okay. Guess I don't get a choice in the matter. I'm just gonna cheer. Do it, guys. Cheer for me. Hmm. Right. Man, this cheer move is, like, overpowered. Like, it, it does so much for you, and with how, like, easy coins are to come by... I don't know, maybe it's just because I'm an adult, but it's like, anytime I see a mechanic like that in a game, it's always, like, way easier to get than, uh, than you'd expect from how they treat it. Ah, crap. Whoa, oh, whoa! 49! Oh my god, that's a lot of damage. It's okay. It's, I'm okay. It's okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. Don't worry about me. Shit. Mm, let's cheer again, but we'll only do like 300. That didn't help a great deal, but whatever. Great lineup. All right. Well, I'll just hit these guys with the hammer. Because I can actually take them out with that. Excellent. We're going to go with... Uh, shiny boots that sparkle. Actually, they're flashy. Flashy and fleshy are a little too... A little too close to each other, I know about that. Here we go, here we go! Excellent! Got him. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take it to the Velemental fight and then call it a night. Which is slightly earlier than I plan to end, but that's, that's okay. Saving. Ooh, boy. Another pushing puzzle, huh? All right, I don't even know what I'm trying to accomplish with it, so let's just fill in the gaps for right now. Okay, and then we'll see uh, what it is we actually need to do. Ah, mother! Hmm. Okay, okay, that's fine. That's fine! 
three moves. Hmm. I guess scoot these out of the way. Scoot him up. Nope, nope. Hmm, I'm gonna use a cheer. Why not? At this rate, at this price, I'd be mad not to. There we go. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Not the other one. That one's a little racial. I'm not, I'm not a fan of that. Jump, jump, and jump. All right. There we go. Give me the coins. We're gonna get get through to see what we're actually accomplishing here. Whoa! Woo! Oh. Okay, I just gotta get it into that spot. Let's see, how close can I get with what I have here now? Uh, I can do it with this. Yeah, I'm gonna still go into that reset door, but uh, oh, wait a minute. Here we go. Crush, 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 crush. Uh, let's hit him one more time. It's better to finish off what you got than to uh, waste your time on something fresh, you know? Especially because if I take them out, then they can't attack me. I'm gonna have two, right? Yeah, there we go. And that. I've really gotten the hang of these. I feel. And also, like, knowing that the toads are so useful is really helpful. Oh. Ooh. Excuse me. My goodness. My gracious. Uh, oh, no. I can't do it from here. Okay, that's fine, though. I'll just hop in here. See what's up. Is it a heart? No. Oh well. It's a thousand coins. And a useless bag of confetti. Hmm. So I need to get it down there. Huh. So I need to make... Need to make something of a funnel shape. Okay, so we're gonna go over here, pop it down here. Pop it down here, go around there. Fuck, I fucked it up. Mm, er, wait, did I. Did I actually. Hmm. No, actually, I can salvage this. I just gotta... What's that? What's this? Hmm. No, if I bust that one... Hmm. No, I think I messed this up. Let me reset it. So I need to get it. I need to get it there. Oh, oh yeah, this is way easier than I was thinking. Okay. 
so we're gonna go down. Down. No, shit. Hold on. Let me try this again. Okay. So... Let me think this out. So we go... We have to get over there or over there. Can't get over there, so we gotta get up against this solid block here. So how do I do that? Um... If I... If I go down there... No, that won't work. Um, hmm. Let's see, it's gonna go across there. I need to get it... I need to work it backwards. Okay, so I'm going to bump it off of that. So the only way to get there is to go across. The only way to go across is to get right there. The only way to get right there is to get it over here. So I need to loop it all the way around. Yes. Oh, I'm an idiot. The gray ones were a fucking guide. Okay, so we go around here, around there, do this, do that, go there, whoops, go there, there we go, I figured it out, are you proud of me, mummy, are you proud of your child, whoa, 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 that's very aggressive, sir, Sir, that's very aggressive. Sir! Ooh, ooh. Damn it. Hmm. Oh. oh, this one's easy. Just pop, pop. And you do, do, do. The cow. Sometimes they just give you so many. I wonder how close I even am to the elemental. I might, I might just get there and then stop it there for the night. We'll see, you know. I don't want to go too long. I'm already getting a little tired. And the more tired I am, the more the quality suffers. Line them up. Um, what? Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna make that cheer, why don't we? Let's make it a variety cheer. Only need the flashy boots on this one. Oh man, that chain effect is fantastic. I love it. Or at least I greatly appreciate it. Why can't the confetti just go in the hole? Why must it be me flaunting it out? Okay, so what's the trick here? What's the trick? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What am I supposed to do here? Can I jump up anywhere? I can jump up in here. What does this do? Is it pipe? Hmm. Well, I found a treasure. That's pretty good. But 
that's not what I'm looking for. Aha, uh -huh, sneaky secrets. The sneakiest of secrets. Oh. Takes me back out front. Okay. I'm guessing then that uh gonna need a shortcut soon. Alright. Let's let's figure this out. Whoa, 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 watch out. Careful. Alright, alright. Oh, I gotta time it. Yeah. That's how we do it, eh? That's how we do it downtown. Damn it. There we go. Give me the block. Give me the block. Ha 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 ha. Can't get me. Can't get me. And there we go. Bam. Good work. Go me. Self five. Come on now. Come on now. Give me those last little bits of trade. Not bottomless hole repaired. Saving, save complete. Onward we go. Well, mm, before I jump down there, let me see. Let me see the lay of the land here. Oh, okay. Guess I don't have an option, so I don't even know. I don't know what that was about. But okay, let's go. Woo! We're going real fast. Oh boy. Is this it? Oh jeez. The teeth! The teeth! Ouch! His poor tooths. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Get up. Get up, you plumber bastard. What is this place? Well, it's a mountain, as you so eloquently put it. Oh man, I hope I get like some traction boots or something, because I'm, I'm having a rough time with this one. Hmm. Oh, is this it? Is this the fight? Shit. Well, okay, I guess I'll do the fight. I'll do the fight, and then I'll finish this off. No. Careful, Mario. Careful. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on now. He got some big old claws. He is a bear, though. So, you know how that goes. Those claws look pretty sharp. What the fuck? Oh, well, that's... Yeah, I just got it. Uh, where's the on switch? What I want to know is where's the caveman? Hmm. Well, this isn't too difficult. But that's about all I can do, so bah. On button. Uh, flashy boots, I guess? Let's see how it works. You know what? Should've used a hammer. Should have used the hammer. Oh my god. Oh my god. Watch out. Mario, watch out. Mario, watch out. Uh, nope, nope, nope. I didn't mean to do that. Alright, we go with that. We go here. And we do fire. Shit. Fucked up, but you know what? I will just use a fire flower. That should work fine. It is fire after all. 
Wow. A little something. It wasn't super effective, but it could have been worse. Oh, jeez. All right, let's try that again. Let's do that correctly this time, please. There we go. Fire. Spit hot fire. Here we go. Do the that. And then, yeah, she's gonna do the fire. It's gonna melt it. Presumably. Melted. One damage, that's it. It's not incredibly effective. Well, I guess I'd just do that again. I mean, it's probably weak to fire, being ice and all that. Or not, I guess. I guess that's not around, but, uh. Let's just. Let's just pop this in there. Plus one. Okay. See, so yeah, I guess I gotta do this. Here we go. Thousand fold arms. Get it and hit him. Bow, bow, bow. Bop him. Bop him. That's too dizzy. That's right, motherfucker. Fucker. Wow, either either I've just gotten really good at this game or this shit is crazy easy. Mm-hmm. And then we'll Fuck. Hold on. I'll just do that and then we'll do yeah, we'll do that. Uh, okay, that's not on Switch, so I don't know what you expect of me there. Shiny Fire Flower. Get him. Nice, already got him doing a half health. That's pretty good. Blocked. Woof, does a lot of damage. Not the ground. I needed that. I needed the ground. Mm. That's rough, buddy. Alright, uh, no, uh, shit, I need the other one. I can do this. Then it takes us to that. Mmm, can I get the times two? Nah. That's okay. A thousand fold arms. Grab him. Grab him. Ouch. He's spiky. Damn it, so I have to use the fire on that. Okay. Okay, we'll see how that goes. Shit. Oof, yeah, shit's getting getting real now. Okay. Which then does this. And oh, I need some help. Yeah, I'm just gonna heal up and save it for later. I'll just coins. Well, I don't really need that, but okay. Frozen? Shit. That's not what I meant to do then. Ouch. The piercing cold. Yeah, I know. I've been there, bruh. Let's see. We're gonna do 
this... Ah, shit, actually. I gotta make sure. <sighs> hmm. Or shit, I gotta make sure that I... This is out of the way. Oh, is that how you do it? Okay. Hold on, I'm gonna buy a, as much time as I possibly can. Uh huh. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go on a quick break. Let's see if I can do it in time. Okay, I'm back. Uh, how much time do I have? Oh, I have tons of time. Okay, whew. Oh, that was risky. Okay. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's just go. Here we go. Fire up. <clears throat> go, Olivia. You can burn them. Can. Okay. That's pretty good. Alright, I gotta dodge this. We'll block it. Bowler bear? That's that's the silliest pun I ever damn heard. Okay, I need to get to that hand. Okay, this one's easy. Just gotta go like that, that. And that. There we go. Let's see if I can take him out this time. Magic circle on. Hands together and go. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. Take him out. Damn. Oh, he's dizzy. I think I can get him one more time here. The ice maze. Fuck, dude. Um. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Okay. So, fuck, all right, it was, hold on, that was up there. Okay, that was there. Ah. That was there, and this was like that, yes, okay. Here we go. Here we go, gotta slap him. Hit hit him. Rush him up. Take him out, take him out, take him out. Was that it? Was that it? No, he has one HP left. Whoa shit. That's fine, that's fine. I can hit him for one. No problem. Okay. That's fine, that's fine. 
I can make that make sense. Um, come on, what are you doing now? Fuck. Okay, so I gotta switch that one over there. And then switch this one. Like that. And just do that. Yes. All right, we got him. We got him. Take this, you big old bar. Your big old polar bar. Here we go. Here we go. Get him. Crushed him. Legit. Oh, I just sprayed water all over the dang desk. That's fine. It's just little droplets. I don't think it hit anything important. <clears throat> no, he's dead. <laughs> There's the folio, folio, that helps you do the thing you do, that you do. Nice. Or the biblio fold. You got it. Nice bibliofold. All right. Let's get right down to it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, I get it. Fold it here like this and connect these two like this. Oh, sneaky. Okay. Nice. Let's do it. Let's get right to it. Do it, Olivia. Fold yourself up. Get folded. Oh, that was a weird little pop. But that wasn't anything important. <clears throat> Whoa! She's got the little dingly donk on her freaking head. Oh, hold on, that's my mic. Sorry about that. Thought that was in the soundtrack. Can you still hear me, right? Yeah. Frozen. Ice. Raw. It's all froze up. Cool. I froze the water into solid ice. Let's do it, Olivia. Is there anything cool down here that I'd want to see all frozen? Ooh, ooh. Yes. Secrets. Sneaky secrets. Ooh, the origami craftsman. Here of all places? Hmm. Oh my god, you slip sliding everywhere. You know, and it's not the worst. But it can be a touch annoying. Let's get going now. Going now. And then we will do the thing. Do the thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't fall. Mario, don't fall. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, that's fun. Whoa! Thunk. Nice. <laughs> Happy bears. Alright, let me find a... Ooh, sneaky secret. Let me go find a save point, and then I will do those challenges on Thursday when I return. Just want to remind you all that... Uh, you can always follow me here on Twitch. It is free, and it helps out the channel a great deal. So I'd really appreciate it if you took the time to do so. As long as you have a Twitch account, you can follow for free, and then you'll get a notification whenever I go live. See more of my fun, fun streams. All right, down the hole. Here we go. Save. 
save completed. All right, that'll do it for tonight, folks. Thanks for tuning in, whether you're tuned in now, in the past, or in the future with the past broadcast tab, which you can find here on the browser version, or on my uh, YouTube archive, which you can find down below the stream on the browser version, along with my personal YouTube and my Twitter, at IggyDKid, which is where I tweet out whenever I go live, along with the schedule, which for the time being is just going to be Tuesdays and Thursdays, Paper Mario, and Saturdays is going to be uh, uh, Pokemon which is going to be a little bit of a longer stream, like 8 to midnight, but that's what it's going to be for the time being. Subject to change, come check it out. You know, follow me on Twitter. You'll see what I'm streaming when it happens. Um, yeah, like I said, take the time to follow. I really appreciate it. It really helps the channel out, and it is free for you, so why not? You know, only takes one click, and you just get a notification. It's pretty good, pretty good. You know, pretty nice. Um, hmm, anything else? No, nope, that's pretty much it. I'd just like to thank you for tuning in, and I hope that I entertained you. Thanks for inviting me into your home, your tablet, your computer, your phone, wherever you watched. I really appreciate it letting me spend some time with you. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you'll enjoy it in the future. Please come back for more. Good night, everyone. <laughs>